Please welcome Don Rickles. It's good to see you now. Have a seat. Control yourself. Control yourself. I uh, will have a seat, but Kevin went bananas. Pull yourself together. <laughs> Gee, I'm not with the Lakers. I, I think they thought you were Henry Gonzalez from the Whitewater hearing. <laughs> Did you? Thanks. <laughs> well, it's good it's to see you. It's going to be a long night. Yes. Indian talk, long night. No, it's, it's wonderful to be here. Nice it really to have is. you. Thanks for asking me. I, uh, since Johnny went off, I haven't been on with you for some time. You know, I was hit by a truck, but you were busy. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I was driving the truck. I was, uh, you were driving the truck. <laughs> Sweet out of a guy. I'm going to suck your neck. Really? Now, having a good time, Kevin? Oh, yes. Yeah, sure. Well, they're getting rid of you. Now, uh, Marcellus phoned in and said, Kevin has a personality. Now, <laughs> hey, hey, for the money you paid, this is funny stuff. <laughs> This is a nice crowd, though. The Very people nice love crowd. you. And it's Probably. nice of you to... Love you, too. <laughs> I get the feeling I'm at a pep rally or someplace. <laughs> you say hello. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Sorry to get excited, No, Jake. no. It's, it's... I know that throws you excitement, but... Uh... <laughs> We know each other a long time. We do know each other a long time. Thanks, Jay. That's a big help. In fact, uh, in fact, what? In fact, yours was one of the very first comedy albums I bought. You know really? That? I know. I have them both here. That's why I bought them. Oh here. my God! Have you Let seen me... these in years? No, I haven't seen. Hello, these. dummy, and Don Rickles speaks. There he is. My and mother I... would say, "Turn that crap off." <laughs> my mother never used the word crap until I played your record. <laughs> Turn that crap off. You listen to it. You listen to Jack Benny. What do you listen to that man yelling at people for? Uh, you're so sweet. And you're so good to your mother. And she's in Boston now going, Mom, what do they got anybody in? They do it that. that. They got anybody in? And you know, she's walking around getting an immigration paper stamped every day. And she's an American, for crying out loud. Considering she's from Scotland, that's very good. She's from Scotland? But look at you. Look at you. Very dapper here. Look at him with the, look at him with the cigarette here. Look at this kind of. Well, of uh, course. I was a handsome young guy. Mr. Continental. Had a few bad breaks, and that's it. You know? <laughs> but I was young then, and those were, those were the days when Bill Cosby and Bob. Bob Newhart, yeah. the button-down mind of Bob Newhart. Yeah. Oh. And those were the days when albums were big, you know, right. and now that's over with, and I'm on this. Right. But uh, <laughs> that's the way this business goes. You reach out, you try to get lucky. You know, I heard Kevin was the star tonight, and I said, I got to be on with Kevin, you know. That was my whole life, you know. Now, you're back from where? You've been on the road a lot? Uh, no, no. I, uh, on the road, yes. I was painting the middle line on the road a lot. Yeah. <laughs> on the road a lot, your mother come home on the road a lot. No, I was. I just came back. As a matter of fact, I went to a great place. Mm -hmm. It was called the... It's, it was called... It's the Foxwood Casino, owned by the Piqua Indians. Oh, you're doing well. Oh, you kidding? They circle a hotel every night. Oi, 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 oi. That joke now, could cost me. Now, where but, is uh, it? Now, where, I didn't know you were doing... I, I do know. Indian reservations. I'm not like you. You show up in Vegas for two nights, and I say, sold out, can't get in. Any moron for two nights can be sold out right. with, where you're on every night, for crying out loud. What is the challenge? I go to an Indian reservation where they're sitting in loincloths in the front with arrows going, I never go in there, I never go in there. <laughs> and I keep saying, I love Geronimo, I love Geronimo. And I had a wonderful time there. They were great. Yeah. I really did. I gave them a bucket of corn, and they left me alone. <laughs> Now, do you, uh, do you gamble when you go to these places? Are you a big gambler? I gamble on my act. Yeah. yeah no, well, no, I, I, I don't, I, no, I never gambled. In really? Years, I've been in Vegas over 35 years at the, between, between the Desert Inn and, uh, and uh, the MGM. Never Grand. gambled at all? Never gambled at all. Never, in fact, I did a picture years ago with Goss and Kane, and they said, deal the cards in the hands with dancing. I had dancing hands. I don't know because my father was a soul. What do you mean dancing hands? Dancing hands. What are you a moron? Don't you yes. know what dancing hands are? Oh, wait, wait, dancing oh, hands anybody? are dancing hands like this from the nerves. Oh, I see. You mean you were nervous? Yes. What else? Smart as a whip. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Well, you know, you're scary. You've got this big show. You make $40 million a year, and you guessed this is, means you're nervous. A lot of these... <laughs> I can't believe it. I'm working with a scientist. A lot of these 
these expressions from the 40s throw me. Well, of course. That's why you're on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because, so, go ahead. so you got dancing hands, and what happened? Well, no, because I, I never dealt cards, and yeah. I never, you know, not too good at gambling, and yeah. never played, never played bridge, never played poker. Did you? No, I'm not a gambler at all, actually. I don't what do you do? Well, I do what you, I do. I, I go to Vegas. I do. And you my sit show. around all day long well, in your garage. Do? Well, now, what I do know do? what you do. You I sit in your garage, garage. going. <laughs> Uh, Mavis, the damn thing is stuck again. Ow, 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 ow. And Mavis is underneath the hood going, I'll fix it, Jay. <laughs> now, what do you do? What do you do in Las Vegas? None of your business. Nah, there you go. <laughs> you do no, the same thing, I but do, the car. I, I make love to the wife. <laughs> all, right, and, uh, all right, there's two minutes. Now what? Two minutes? Yeah, Why? Two minutes. Oh, you're the one that timed me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Anyway, uh, I thought you were working the light. <laughs> anyway, uh... <laughs> <laughs> I'm married 29 years. How long are you married? Uh, almost 15. How come? But I must say, uh, no, I know your wife. She's lovely. She lovely. really is. Lovely woman. And your wife, a lovely woman also. Of course. Thank you very much. We both have lovely women. Now let's get some broads. <laughs> no, no, no. Hey, hey, I love my wife. May God paralyze me if I would cheat on her. a question people wonder. You know, you, you say matter of factly, you're in Vegas, you're making love to the wife, boom, boom, boom. How often exactly. does Don, Don Rickles make love to the wife? How many times a week? <laughs> More than 21? More than 21? No, I would say <laughs> I wake up in the morning, take, boom, shot. Right. <laughs> and that, and that pretty, that's noon. pretty much the extent of it, isn't it? No, no. Hey, don't tell me how many times. What do you do with Mavis? You stand I'm, by Mavis, I, I just... circle the bed and go, I'm rich, fake it. <laughs> Well, go ahead. You, you brought up, you said, I'm making love with a wife. Boom, well, sure, I said it. I didn't make it like boom, boom, boom. You're talking like I'm with a hooker or something. <laughs> There's a woman of 29 years, a nun I married, a nun. She, on the wedding night, I, and I was around, you know, before, I, you, really? as we all know, when we're young comedi comedians and you were as a young man, well, when you, you're still young. Right. But when in my day, when you're a comedian, you always fell in love with the singer. I met my wife and I fell madly in love with her. In those days, she said, listen, that's the way she talks. She goes, listen. Did you, did you futz around at all when, before you met me, did you? Now, who did you I marry, Richard you, Simmons? I'm talking to the people. Sounds like Richard Simmons you married. Richard's, no, I'm, I'm not that desperate. Give me a break. For, I marry Richard Simmons, you're gonna see me in shorts, skipping down the park, going, we're free, we're free. <laughs> No, Richard Simmons is a good guy. I don't want to let the no. people be misled. <laughs> We'll take, a, we'll take a break. We'll find out more about the sexual antics, ladies and gentlemen, of Don Ripple. Right it became now. a horny show. Maybe people don't know about you. You're like a huge sports fan. Dodgers fan? You big Dodgers oh, fan? Oh, Tommy Lasorda is uh, yeah? my idol. Oh, is that right? In fact, we have a wall in the Dodger dressing room um, from the last phone call. Uh, and it's the Don Rickles wall and the Tommy and the Frank Sinatra wall. Uh, Frank isn't here tonight, but he's my life, uh, if I may. Frank, I swear to God, I, I never touch Vito. <laughs> <laughs> you got to do that, otherwise he hurts the family. <laughs> but, uh, you know, and, and uh, Tommy's been a great friend to us, yep. and the Dodgers are, are doing great. They have a plan this year. They plan to finish the season. Oh, okay. good. And, uh... How many games do you make? Well, I have season seats, and I, I, I think I went twice. But, uh, <laughs> see, they, they, uh, Peter O'Malley used to have it on Prime Ticket. Now we don't have it on Prime Ticket. So when I go, I go down the dressing room. Yeah. And, and it's, a, it's an effort, but I love Tommy, and I love the ball club. Right, right. And Tommy makes me go to each stall. And they're all, the Dominion Republic, they're all young kids, and they're wonderful young men, you know. But, you know, they, they know to get on the bus, go to the hotel, they're taken everywhere. So I go to each uh, cubicle, and I say, hey, like uh, I'll say to uh, when Offerman was up, I say, or, or uh, with the... Uh, the different pitches, you know, from the Dominion. I say, how are you? Mr. Riga, you talk to Tommy. I'm ready to play. Talk to Tommy, will you? I'm ready to play. And I walk around, I stamp their hand, and they're happy. <laughs> but, uh, 
the, the, the thing is, the thing is that the, that the whole thing, when I leave, I feel like I'm the president of the United States. These guys are so appreciative. You know, Mike Piazza, you don't have to do that. I say, Mike, how do you feel? Hey, oh, I'm going to hit a homer. And, you know, and you give him a cookie and he goes away. Right. It's a whole damn thing, you know. Well, how about, how about, like, the is always on these diets. You ever go on those with him? No, no, I, diet? those diets are, they, they give you what we call in Mexico, like, when you, when you, when you drink that drink, I, I don't want to mention the product. Don't want to mention it. I, no, but it's when you drink that shit. drink, if I may stand up, when you drink yes. that drink, you go, I lost weight. <laughs> <laughs> and then a Mexican guy on the highway going, you have trouble, Mr. Rieger? <laughs> And so, uh, I stopped drinking that because the seat in my toilet started to get warped. Really? And, uh, so I didn't drink it anymore, you know, and Tommy's still doing it, but now he walks funny. Right. So, uh, but the Dodgers are, are you a Dodger fan? Uh, I'm not a big baseball fan. Do you fan, get out of the house at all? I don't get out much, no, no. You sit in the house with a candle with Mavis going, we're rich. Spirit is Santi Tutti Tutti. We are rich. What a bounty. Pull up the car, Mavis. <laughs> <laughs> now, how about golf? Are you a golfer? Do you play golf? I do play golf, but every time I play, I volunteer for the Jerry Lewis telethon. Now, see, I can't imagine you playing golf. Golf, because it's all golf to me is always, he's about to butt. He's getting up to the green. I mean, yeah. it seems like gentlemen tiptoeing and whispering. Well, I went down just recently with Bob Newhart and uh, Jerry Prince Show and his wife Margie. They're lovely people. We went down to a place called Cabo San Luca. And I'm not a good golfer. And Bob is like, you know, oh, yeah, I'm lying too. You know, that's his life. You know, he reads the books. And Margie, great golfer, and Jerry, great golfer. And I'm, and I, I gotta be honest, Jay, I, I'm lucky to show up on the golf course. You know, I swing and I go, ha, ha. And then I hear, walk on, walk on with hope in your heart. <laughs> anyway, so, uh, and that keeps me playing. You I know. see, I so, see. So, we get, <laughs> it's a little deep, folks. Don't make me put up cards. Don't make me put up cards. <laughs> And so I, 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 I did this, and I play golf, and I play badly, but I enjoy it. But, you know. but Margie said, there's, and they pay for a couple of bucks, Margie Prentcher said, listen, there's a putt from, from where your hand is mm -hmm. to here. She said, Don, if you sink this putt, we make $25. And I said, okay, Margie, don't make me nervous. As soon as I hear money, I go crazy. I'd rather give it to charity and say, hey, boom, here's $25. Let me, she said, just, just make it. And I take the putt the putter, and I go, boom, seven miles past the hole. <laughs> the woman looks at me and goes, what is that, cute? <laughs> what, what are you doing? I said, Margie, I can't. When I hear money, I go crazy, because <laughs> I was never a gambler. And the whole thing was that the damn thing went past the hole, and boom, and they have nervous breakdowns. And Newhart does this great line. Uh, I, 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 you, 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 you missed the putt. <laughs> So you got dancing hands as you were... Uh... Dancing hands. You never let up on that, huh? No, no. I just, it's, it's, it's a new I hope you go to Cedars and my cousin's your doctor. <laughs> and standing over the bed and Jay goes and they have to say, all right, Jay, just sit quiet. We're going to punch you once and hope the jaw snaps up. Mm. <laughs> oh, your burger's old. Thank you, man. Thank you very Take much. Take a look at him. He can't drink a soda without dribbling all over himself. <laughs> You put him over the fireplace, nobody's gonna know the difference. <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh, Wait, boo, I want you to do something. Here, here's I want you your boo. 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 I want you to do something. It's gonna be a race riot. No, no. Let, let's have the audience. Don, just turn your head this way. Is that a coconut? <laughs> Okay, Jay leading, one nothing going into the last half. And the real trick is when you're ahead, is to get out when you're ahead. Ladies yeah. and gentlemen, Mr. Don Rickles. <laughs>